welcome back to my channel. Now I've always had a bit of a love-hate relationship when it comes to mammography cameras. I think they're a great way to have fun and experiment with photography and actually a really great way to get into film photography. But I think they're way overpriced for how temperamental they can be. So today I headed out to Lewis, a really beautiful small town in East Sussex, with this, the Diana F Plus, to see what kind of images you can get from this camera. Um, it's a medium format camera and if you're not too familiar with the settings I'll quickly run through them and then I'll show you what kind of footage and images I got from my day. So above the lens we have an N and a B. The N is for normal daytime shooting and B is for long exposures. We then have these symbols underneath the camera which control the aperture. You have a cloud, a cloud and a sun and a sun as well as a P which stands for pinhole. So according to the website the cloud is f11, partial cloud f16 and then the sun is f22 and the pinhole is f150. Um, I mostly stuck to the cloud setting as I live in England but I did also give the pinhole settings a try um, so you'll see what they came out like. So I hope you enjoy the footage and I do apologise I've been ill for the last two weeks so I'm not looking my best but I just want to put a video out there so I hope you enjoy. are a bit of a mixed bag. Um, I took two photos of the same scene so you can see how important getting the right setting is on this camera. The image on the left was shot in the cloud setting and the one on the right was shot with the partial cloud setting. Now also due to the fact the shutter speed is set at 160th I would definitely recommend using a tripod to avoid blur in images. I really enjoy shooting the Dian F Plus but if you factor in developing costs it's really quite an expensive way to have fun so I probably won't be using it too often. And that is it for today's video. Next week I'll be uploading another video in the series of the Photographer's Playbook. And I hope you all have a great weekend.